Now let us consider how to grade and give remarks in Excel. To grade in Excel, we use the if statement. So it's also a formula. So type equal to, then we have, let's come to the formula bar over here. Then if, so we select the if. So logical test. Logical test means we are going to compare the cell J2. So if cell J2 is greater than 90, then we want Excel to output a then comma else if into bracket then we have the same g2 if g2 is greater than 80 then we want excel to output b if into is greater than 60 we want excel to bring we want excel to output good we want excel to output c so if g2 is greater than 50 you want to say i want to output d then if g2 is less than 50 Then you want to output E. Then we close the parentheses as many as the number of E's we have. So we have one, two, three, four, five. Then we press enter. So you can see that ESA has graded this for us to be C. Then let's drag this to fill the other cells. Now we want to give remarks. To give remarks is almost the same as the grading. So let's copy this and modify it. So control C. Then we come here. So we come to the remarks column then select the formula bar and paste now we we'll change the a to excellent then we we'll change the b to very good then we we'll change the c to good we we'll change the d to pass and we we'll change the e to fail then after that we press enter so we just fill this to the last entry now if you want to rank them you just have to go to this column then go to sort sort from largest to smallest so you can see that the students are now ranked in order so any changes that you made over here will affect the score over here so let's say Tony Neymar has now scored 91 instead of 19 they would have gotten a very good score then let's say this one is 92 instead of that 
it would have got an excellent grade. So whatever changes you made over here will be made automatically throughout the formulas.